Now we are going to talk about how we can mass change values in uh, FBL3 and transaction for general ledger balance. Okay, so if you click on execute, and here, suppose I want to change, suppose I'll try to bring in a, a field here. Hmm. Let me see, document status, and probably, let's see any other things I can bring in. So yeah, let's bring this thing, whether it gets changed or not, okay? So now what we are going to do, we are going to ed edit, select all, and we click on this mass change, okay? Now here you can see text, we'll put test. And I don't know whether we have payment method, let's see. What I'll do is I'll just close this and I'll try to bring payment method here. So let's select payment, let's select method. Let's see, payment method is there, and I bring it here, copy, and see the payment method is blank. So I'll make changes to the text and the payment method. So let's put payment method something. So I'll put T, no, I'll put direct debit, and I'll put a GL, a test, and let's see whether it goes, it completes something. I'm able to change every document, so that's the error message they gave. So I think the payment method changes should not happen, so probably the text only happens, so we'll just change, and we'll say, GL test, let's see, execute changes. So changes have been made, if you see. Now we'll go select, refresh. And now you see the text has been changed. For GL, GL balances, you cannot change payment method. It's always blank. Okay, so here if you see it's GL test, we changed it. Now suppose we will just for for fun, we'll make another changes. We'll go to edit, select all, and we'll click on this mass change, and we'll put uh, test as for Hana. Okay, and we'll select this execute changes. Okay, now if you notice, this is not yet changed. You need to go to here, click on refresh. And that's there it is test as for HANA. So imagine if you have thousands of these, you need to change. This is very helpful for accounts payable as well as financial people and in the month end, year end, quarter end to release their result and do their reclass and add, add and update multiple means multiple uh, documents with the same value. This is very important. So that's it for updating mass changes for GLR balance in FBL3N. Stay tuned to my channel and happy SAP learning.